Hello everyone, how are you all doing out there today? I'm Michelle the Introvert and it's the weekend and guess what fun project I have on the go right now? I've got something special going on in my bread machine and I have something special down here on my countertop. Come take a look my friends, it's going to be a fun night. That right there, that's pizza crust and that is going to make Joshua a wonderful pizza for tonight and he's going to help out by putting what he wants on there and in this bread machine over here it's on the go and the dough that's in there is going to make Gerald and I a really nice pizza crust as well you can see a little bit of action going on in there it looks really good but back to what we want to do for Joshua. I don't have any pizza pans quite yet, but I'm looking at investing in some. But for the time being, I'm just going to use this rectangle one here. And what I did is I put some of this cooking spray on there so the pizza crust doesn't stick to it. So now my next step, my friends, is to get this pizza crust all rolled out so we can fit it inside this pan and then Joshua can have a little bit of fun putting his ingredients on. It's not going to take me long to get this kneaded a tiny little bit and then afterwards I'll put it in the pan. Alright, let's see what I can do with this here. I've got to stretch this out so it touches all four corners. And then Joshua can put the pizza sauce on the top. There, that looks pretty good. We got her all smoothed out pretty good. All the corners. See here? Yes, that looks great. I'm very happy with that. So now I'm just going to get my pizza sauce out of the cupboard. Now what I'm using tonight isn't actually called pizza sauce. What we did is we picked up this here, this primo thick and zesty garlic and herb. We thought, Gerald and I thought this might, might taste really, really nice. So this is what we're going to put on that pizza crust right there. Are you all ready to work on your pizza? Yeah. All right, sounds great. So here's what we have for ingredients. And I do have the mozzarella cheese on the other counter, but we'll bring that over in just a few minutes. So we have pepperoni, ham, salami, some pineapple here. In the blue bowl here, we have some pieces of hot dogs and mushrooms right there. Joshua wanted some olives, so we have some olives there. And in the blue bowl in the back, there are pieces of green pepper there. So it's great. It's going to be a lot of flavor, I think.
terrific, Joshua. Thank you. Good job. So there's Joshua's wonderful pizza. And I just turned the oven on to 475 degrees and it will be in there for about 20 to 25 minutes. And there it is, Joshua's pizza. It is definitely a thing of beauty. What do you think of that, Joshua? Looks good. Yes, it looks pretty amazing and it smells really, really good. We have to wait a couple minutes though before we cut it, but that's all right. I'm just gonna go get the pizza cutter. Ta -da! Here's my handy dandy pizza cutter and we're ready to roll. Josh was going to enjoy his pizza that he made. I just have to wait a few more minutes till Gerald and I get our pizza crust out of here. In the meantime, Josh was going to be enjoying his pizza and he has a little bit of Dr. Pepper to wash it down with. My friends, I want to thank you for joining us tonight and if you like this, this pizza vlog, please give us the YouTube thumbs up or press that subscribe button. That would be great. In the meantime, I have more vlogs to come, so stay tuned and I'll talk to you all soon. Everybody have a great weekend. Talk to you soon. Bye.